keep warmer for longer with this must have product when you're on your snorkeling and open water swimming adventures. Hi everyone and welcome back to Mike's Dive Store. I'm Lauren and today I'm going to be talking to you about and showing you the waterproof R30 rash guard in both long sleeve and short sleeve. So today I'm going to be featuring some of its amazing highlights and I'm also going to be taking both of them on my ocean adventures so you can see what the product's like in action and you can see it in my full review. Now let's take a closer look with unboxing these two rash vests and here I have the long sleeve and the short sleeve rash vest. This also comes in men long sleeve and short sleeve. Here as you can see it also comes in plastic free packaging which is what we always love. With an added extra layer for protection, it will protect you from harmful UV rays as it's a great alternative to using sunscreen as it offers 50% UV protection factor. Also, with an added extra layer, it helps you to stay free from rashes caused by bites or stings. This rash vest is designed for wearing on its own or under a wetsuit to stop rubbing. Either way, this rash vest is sure to keep you warm in the water and ensures longer ocean adventures. This rash vest is made from lycra and spandex, making it lightweight, quick drying and water wicking. As it's made from lycra and spandex, it offers better UV protection than your t-shirt, swimming costume and even sunscreen might. I highly recommend using this rash vest if you want to go on holidays as it won't take up too much room in your luggage. It's super lightweight and thin so it won't weigh up too much in your luggage allowance. This type of rash vest is best suited to those who want extra protection when snorkeling or if you're diving in lovely troll, warm tropical waters and you don't need a wetsuit, then this rash guard will do just the trick in keeping you protected from abrasion. Now let's see how I found it when I went snorkeling. I found that this material was very flexible and made the rash guard very easy to get on and off. It stuck quite close to my body which ensured I stayed hydrodynamic yet I still felt like I could move easily within the rash vest as it was very flexible. This rash guard was quite long so there was no body exposure and risk of getting sunburnt. So that's it for today's video. If you have any questions about any of the rash guards that I talked about today, please make sure to reach out to us at support at mikesdivesort.com. I've also included the link below. This is where we have a team of qualified scuba diving professionals here to help you out with any questions that you have. And thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to keep more up to date on advice, product reviews, scuba news, snorkeling things and tips and advice, please make sure to click the subscribe button below. And make sure to check out our existing playlist for more educational content. And wherever you choose to go snorkeling next and whatever rash guards or exposure protection that you choose to invest in, make sure you have happy snorkeling adventures and stay safe.